Hello, hello my dear friends, and today I'm going to show you how to make red borscht. That's Russian soup, <clears throat> and it's really good. So, I'm going to be making it with beans today. So, we will need uh, one carrot grated, half of a large red sweet pepper diced, two bay leaves, half an onion diced, one medium beet diced, First you peel it and then you dice it. And then we'll need about two tablespoons of tomato paste. One fourth of a small cabbage. We'll need uh, one can of kidney beans. And about two potatoes, two medium potatoes diced. And we'll need about a liter and a half of water. So let's get started. So first we're gonna turn this water to boil. And we're going to also heat our skillet. So then in our skillet I placed half of the beets. The other I saved because we're going to throw it in the soup. So we're just going to let this cook until it softens up a bit. Maybe up to like 10 minutes. And in our other uh, um, skillet, we have this one here, we're going to add in the onions. And we're going to let this cook for about, um, so it can like, kind of lose a color. Now that the water has started to boil, we're going to throw in the rest of our beets. And we're going to throw in our potatoes. I'm just going to cook this so it could be just slightly, slightly boiling. And we're also going to throw in our bay leaves and we're going to season with salt. So due to your own taste. So we're going to cover this and let it boil, boil on medium low. So now once that is done, we're going to throw in our red peppers. Just going to throw all of them. And if you are running out of oil, just add more. I think mine is still good. So just mix this up a few minutes till it softens up a bit. So I have here the cabbage. So what we're going to do, we're just going to grate it down. And the easiest way is... Um, you can either use a knife and just slice it down to thinly, you know, thin pieces, or you can just use a thing that, you know, cuts it down. So we're looking for these kind of pieces, you know, just grating it down. So once the peppers cooked for about five minutes, we're gonna throw in our carrots. Just gonna mix it up again. And let this cook for a few minutes, and we're gonna turn it off. So with the beans, you just want to drain all that stuff out and uh, uh, rinse it in water until it runs clear. So once our potatoes have cooked, we're going to throw in our red beans. Of course, you can always cook your own beans, but this is a faster version. And you do want to take it off heat once the potatoes are done so they don't continue cooking. So this looks great. We're going to turn it off. And this is almost done. It just needs to, you know, soften up. So when you bite it, it's going to be, like, soft. And once that is cooked, we're going to, spoon by spoon, put the uh, beets in here. That way we don't get in the extra oil. So we're trying to minimize as much oil as possible. So now we're just going to mix it up. And we will put in our tomato paste. And like I like to do the tomato paste, I just put some water and I just... Mix it up, that way it turns to more watery. That way it's going to be easier to just throw it in there. Okay, so then you want to turn back the skillet on. And we're going to put in our tomato juice. Just going to let that shimmer for about one minute. And, and combine everything together. Alright, so mix this up. This is all ready, so you want to turn it off heat. So now that we're ready, we're going to turn this water back on to boil. 
and um, while it's warming up we're gonna throw in our beautiful vegetables and our cabbage okay so I placed in that so now we're just gonna cover and we're gonna let this start boiling okay as we can see this has started to boil so now look how red that is that is super red okay so now we're just gonna turn this off once it boils for about 30 seconds to a minute and the soup is all done the only thing we're gonna do now is we're gonna remove all this white uh, this all this orange foam we're gonna take that out so there you have it you can garnish with some greens uh, like parsley there you have it red borscht <coughs> so till next time guys bye bye